to an all new episode of Conflicts. Today I'm excited to show you the all new Batbot Extreme. Extreme! Now this was actually sent over by Fisher Price as well as Mattel. So for your very own, check out their link down below. Now this here is one of the ultimate crime fighting machines in which it has a lot of different gadgets and gizmos which I'm excited to show you. So without further ado, let's go ahead and take a closer look at the box before opening it up. Alright, so this here's our box and as you may notice, it's actually one of the biggest boxes we've reviewed yet. Now you do see a cool looking robot on the front as well as all the different things that go with it. Uh, such as if you look right over here, uh, it will actually show that it does have wings that expand over 3 feet as well as a two-fisted battle action so you can actually control the arms on the back. And then it has a voice control which will mimic the actual robot itself into your voice. And then a shoulder cannon that fires rockets as well as a bat cycle launcher. And then you actually have a Batman figure that goes in an elevator that will go all the way to the top. So it's kind of a lot of different things that are going on which is really exciting. Now on the side here it shows a little bit again about different details. So it does come with all these different components. You got Batman, the Bat Cycle, these launchable uh, discs as well as launchable missiles. And then you can capture a villain and put them in a jail which is behind the foot. As well as a trigger that allows you to control the arms and punch as you want to. Now on the back side here, uh, this will show you a little bit again, uh, different details. So it does show the elevator where the Batman stands and I'll zip him right up uh, in the actual command center. And then yeah, it's really interesting, kind of gives you an idea of what it's about. So let's go ahead and open this up and see what's on the inside. Alright, let's go ahead and slide this guy out. <laughs> Alright, so these are the components that come with it. Uh, we got an instruction manual here. Alright, so we got a few different things here. It shows turn on the power pad to reveal the battle fists and expand the wings, listen to cool sound effects. Uh, there's a button in the back for the microphone and then we turn the pad to reveal the command center along with the sound effects. Uh, you turn the power pad to launch the bat cycle as well as you insert the darts to fire from the top as well as different discs. So let's go ahead and see what this guy's made of and actually build him. Alright, so this here is our bat bot and this thing looks really cool. It's got a lot of different things going on. Uh, and let's just go ahead and start with the top itself. Now one thing you'll probably notice is the missiles and literally you can actually fire them as much as you want. So the way it works is there's triggers on the top and as soon as you pull them, they'll just fire just like so. So it's actually quite interesting. Now the way you load them up is simply just sliding them in and then they'll click in. So it's actually a very fun. Now another thing about this robot is the arms itself that come out and it actually makes it a really cool piece. So the way it works is simple. So what we do is we go ahead and put our Batman on top and then we just go ahead and rotate them and whoa! <laughs> Check that out! These arms popped out just like that and we're ready to fight. Now the way they work is quite interesting. On the back here if we rotate it, you'll actually notice that there's triggers. Now these triggers here will actually control the arms and make them punch, just like that. <laughs> so let's go ahead and take a look at that. So literally when you press the punch button, it, it's actually quite fun. Now another thing about these arms itself is they do fire and what they fire are these cool looking discs. So you just go ahead and slide them in and you're ready to go. So let's go ahead and put them out on each side and we're locked and loaded. And as soon as I press these fire buttons, they'll shoot, just like that. And they go quite far, which is actually a lot of fun. Now, another thing about this robot is the command center. So we put Batman on the top just like this and turn it and check that out. So what this does is you go ahead and put Batman in here, just make him stand and then you just slide it up and he'll click and you'll actually see him in the screen itself. So we'll close that up and we're ready to fight. Now, another unique aspect is the bike. Uh, the way that works is if we look at the bottom, and the way this works is you put Batman on this like this, and then you just turn it, and his bike will come out. And you can go ahead and have our Bat character just ride it, and voila! Our Batman's got the Bat Cycle. Alright, and another feature is the jail cell itself. You just go ahead and lower this here and put our character in there, and our character is now in jail. So, just a little side bit. But yeah, it's actually a lot of fun and it's got a lot of different bells and whistles. Alright, well with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you have any questions about the Bat Robot, feel free to comment down below. Otherwise, thank you again for watching and we'll see you guys next time. Take care now. Bye bye. Ah!